Hey there, I'm Tesla and in this tutorial I'm going to show you one way that we could create a very basic menu using UMG. Okay, so we're going to start by just creating a new level and we want it to be an empty level so it's completely black. Now we're going to add in a new widget blueprint for UMG and we're just going to call this the menu. And we're just going to create something really simple. We're just going to have a new game and a quick game button. So we're just going to grab out two buttons and let's just shape these up a bit. and we'll grab some text and chuck them on and name this one new game and this one as quit game now we want to set up some events for when we click these buttons so we'll click new game come down to the bottom and we see an event unclicked and we can create a new event for that so when we click it we want to open a level and it's just going to be the example map and for the quick game we're just going to create another clicked event and just drag that out and type in quick game and keep that simple so to add this to the viewport we'll just come to the level blueprint create a begin play event and then right click and type create widget come down here and change this to the menu and then drag this one out and type add to viewport so when we start the game it will appear on the screen however we want to see the mouse as well so to get the mouse up we'll just right click and type in show uh, so we'll get the player controller first and then we'll drag that out and type show mouse and we want that to be true and it's slightly offset so what we want to do is open up the widget blueprint and just set this to the center of it and the same for this one and just hit compile and save and then jump in the game and now it's more to the center and when we go full screen it'll stay to the center so we'll hit new game and we go to the new level however the user interface is still there so to get rid of that we're gonna just select the button come down to the graph again actually and we want to remove from viewport after we've clicked the button for new game and we also want to get the player controller once more and we want to set the mouse and we want it to be hidden so we'll leave it unchecked so we jump in we have new game quick game on a black background we can hit new game and now we're in our game Okay guys, that's it. That's just a really quick tutorial looking at how to create a basic menu using UMG. So thanks for checking it out and make sure you check out my website at www.tesla-dev.com for one-on-one -on -one tutoring services. Cheers guys.